Not talking to you, dog. I love you, though. I really do. Uh -uh. I need to turn up my volume for my game. <clears throat> Is it not let me pick the other ones? Why do I have to visit operations? Oh, uh, it won't let me do anything because I have... Global conflict map. You didn't think Legion was only causing trouble in Seoul, did you? From this map, you can assign any of our free agents to investigate Legion hotspots in the world. It's a good way to earn additional resources and discover Legion lairs and elite tech. We'll take our agents a bit of time to investigate these Legion hotspots. I suggest reviewing the complete investigation result. Each time you return to the Ark, the world needs our help agent, but together we can stop Legion's evil plans. <coughs> complete regions do I not have a region key it'll take is it say eight minutes agents have an affinity for specific regions Okay, which is neat. I did not get to stream last night because it is too late. And then I had to fucking work this morning. They made me stay an extra hour, which I don't mind extra cash because a lot of this money is going to go to get myself, like, better off. But then... The excess is going to go towards me constantly getting games and putting that back into my channel. Um, so, yeah. Attention! The company wide meeting scheduled for this Wednesday has been postponed. Widget Yeti has gone missing after meeting with one of his contacts. Already enlisted the other agents to help track down his whereabouts. It's a series of missions to unlock Yeti. Interesting. Um, currently, you'll get a kick out of this. Um, so, I work at a gas station, which is considered a customer service job, because you're constantly dealing with customers. Well, today they were teaching me how to cook chicken, which is strenuous as fuck, and I have to do that tomorrow. But I have Monday off, and then I have Wednesday off. So my two days off, off are coming up. And my first paycheck is Monday. And they do that whole delayed week paycheck. God, it's a bitch. <clears throat> um, but basically, what's currently happened is, is one of my friends is moving into town, so hopefully I'll start playing with him. 
Um. We have arrived. Now move. And uh, my work situation, it's been going good, but like, I swear, like. Working at certain places just is so much fucking drama, and I swear, love's just the biggest load of drama ever, and my coworkers are all, like, super upset. We've got, like, a couple of relatives that are working together, which is a no-go, but one of the relatives that is a really good worker, so it's a bit of a letdown, losing a good person. The assistant manager isn't well liked by everyone else who works there, so the, the up and coming assistant manager. And he's also going through training. The person qualified to be assistant manager can't take the position because her kid works there. So it's 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 a shit show. Um And it looks like I'm not gonna really have to pay much for college anymore, so Kinda got off easy, got all my classes picked out, things 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 seem to be picking up. And I'm gonna try as much as I can in these few days off I have to I gotta help my grandmother with shopping and stuff, but then I'm just gonna play the fuck out of these games. I, I wanna at least Agents, beat one of them. I'm marking the location of a Legion patrol in the city. They've captured a contact of ours who I hope can help us with a small problem. Do we know more? Well, we've lost Agent Yeti. The man's blue and gives people frostbite. Someone had to see him. He went looking for technology from his homeland and, well, got captured, we think. Yeti was meeting with one of his contacts. That's why it's imperative we find them. Time to earn my paycheck. Patrols complete. I found out why Yeti's contact wasn't with the patrol. Seems they were tied to an explosive and left to be blown up. Rescue them before you detonate the bomb, please. You called the right agent. Didn't you shoot a guy in the head Let's in my last stream? Oh, yeah. Hmm? I really wish it would let me fly out of the vehicle. That'd be cool. Grenade loose! Outside the target! I have a shot! Your head! Perfect! We've locked onto Yeti's contact and are bringing them aboard the Ark. Oh dear. Agents, head to the marked location. According to our friend here, Agent Yeti purposefully got himself captured in order to find the information he's after. You'll need to enter a Legion lair and destroy it. <laughs> that guy's still bouncing. It will shut down the locking mechanisms at their prison the site. Fuck the, oh oh my the Legion God. base. Sounds fun. Don't worry, big guy. Holy I'll set shit. you free. Found it. But is the lair in a car? It's in a it's in a box. Access granted. Oh. Very nice. The point One of was no linked return, to a pot, so all the entrances to these are a little weird, I think. Like the place to me. Welcome to <laughs> Theta Nine. The Ministry of Pride invests in you. Please remember to wash your Legion uniform. We may wear masks, but they don't filter out your stench. 
Our latest schematics may be on file here, but what good are they if you die trying to get them? This mission, I gotta check back on what's his name to see how his uh, survey thing went. I was like, what the shit, Biscuit? I just deleted everything from the servers in this base. All that's left is Steel Toe's bad poetry. God, I love his ability. It's just lazy. Hey, kill everyone in the room for me. <laughs> so cool today. I got a bunch of new khakis for work, and my dog got a jumbo pin. So Does now she's got a whole lot of room to play. Everything they find until they get something useful. Damn it. Ninja bitch. Unauthorized access in progress. System breach occurred. Good luck deciphering that data without the encryption key. <laughs> Was somebody supposed to save Yeti? None of my friends are on tonight, which is weird because it's a Saturday night. Finally, get some good abilities for these characters. Legion, wonderful job. Now let's hope wherever he is, Agent Yeti will find what he's looking for. We got another Yeti mission, so at least it lets me continue it. Unlike the Hollywood mission that just ended on a cliffhanger, and that cliffhanger being, I'm pretty sure bad guys got his porn, and not porn he owns. When he's in. These fools never learn. So, uh, 
fuck is that? Who was I before this? I don't know. When are you basically like the I Soviet am. Mr. Freeze? Everyone assumes you are just a mindless brute, but my knowledge of strategy, tactics, where I stood out as a soldier. And I was a soldier for Mother Russia, first and foremost. Our government oh, oh, fell on oh. Devil's Night, but our people fought back. A new revolution, and my country became stronger than ever. Stronger even than me. So I volunteered for an experiment. To turn a mere soldier into Russia's greatest protector, the Cold Warrior. What the fuck? His abilities are better cool. So do I get to place him? Yes, please. I do like the animation for the cutscenes, they're kind of funny. Eight. Report to your designated work area immediately. Follow all requests made by visiting Legion Ministers. Prisoner number 114, this is Barracks Captain PB49. Please return to your cell. It will be no returning to my cell. Then I must warn you, disciplinary measures <laughs> will be undertaken. Mm. Ha, please! Pretty sure one of this guy's skins is the Incredible Hulk. A gun that fired a year, Mr. Freeze, but buff. Yeti's weapon. Huh. All it takes. United Cold Front. Are these all puns? I know that there you're working for Mayhem, but the purple accents just really make you think of, uh... <laughs> fucking soldier pose. Make, make you think of the saints. And... I'm not gonna lie. This game's not bad, but it's no Saints Row. It never will be. Ice thrower. Yeti fires a beam of ice which deals constant damage from short range with an increasing chance to inflict bleed. Oh, his gun only needs to reload because it freezes. I like him. I like him a lot because he's a bit of a tank and I like that. Nowhere to go now, Oh, so 
sick. This gun might be the most effective of all. Attempted system breach detected. Unauthorized acid. System breach occurred. I believe you have something of my people. I will continue to engage brutality until I, I will not be f and behavior <laughs> number one one four. I am a firm but reasonable humanoid simulation. Now return to your cell, and no further disciplinary measures will be needed. <laughs> Special ability frozen solid. I've already performed it. Ground pound resets his weapons ice and mobilizes nearby targets and powers Yeti. His weapon is fully frozen and also inflicts damage. Okay, you see what happened there? I gave you another chance and you blew it. I do not want to be the bad guy. You have forced me into this position. Now, just lie <laughs> still and receive your punishment. And please, if your weapon has any sort of special, do not use it to assail my personnel. <laughs> Did it just ask me nicely and down me? <laughs> Looks like this weapon is reloading. Uh, isn't too much of an issue. It's all the trigger constantly. Heats back up fairly fast. Oh, that's way more powerful. It feels nice to flex my muscles. Attempted system breach detected. Ah, uh, fuck. Unauthorized access has occurred. Oh. reason you have stolen General Winter and there will be no further aggression. No, I do not provide rewards for good behavior. Good behavior is a reward itself. <laughs> a bonus for any trooper who kills a member of Mayhem. Mayhem ability. Prisoner of Ice. She sends out a massive shockwave that stuns all nearby enemies. He also becomes fortified and his weapon immediately freezes. A security team is currently approaching. See, you did it again. Just know I am not the one to blame here. It. You will only get your 
yourself into more trouble. Jesus. Floor security measures. Man, his melee is a lot better than other characters. Number one, one, four. If you continue this course of action, you are forcing me to come down there. Are you sure you want to do that? Yes, it appears we cannot come to any sort of diplomatic solution. Yes, please. I welcome you. Well, just keep this up, and you will see what you get. Oh. Okay. oh. That you have really done it this time. I come. You asked for it. It is disappointing. You may find me harsh, but I am only programmed to respond with punishment based discipline. Perhaps feel nothing. Very well. <laughs> Where is the terminal? I feel like what this game lost and like this is just most a sense of ridiculousness. Is planning to use General Winter against the Korean people. Is that like I feel like the ridiculousness with individual characters instead of like the world itself is nice. Um, I feel like Saints Row like really focused on the fact that like. There was so much fucking chaos. This is, you could wreak chaos, but like, it's pretty much the characters themselves that are the form of it. <sighs> and, I mean, you could make a game off it just what if these characters and they made so many that I feel like it kind of suffers from an identity crisis it struggles figuring out what it is because it's going for like a G.I. Joe aesthetic but then it then it takes off and I don't know the best part of having a robot kinda goes on a dog tangent. there's no dog do to clean up Though there is the occasional oil leak. Uh, that's starting to get old. Legion Tech. Legion Tech are great tools for making gadgets stronger. <coughs> I can build Legion Tech for you. Uh, you, have to have the mis you have to have the materials and the schematics. And then Claymore will make it. Probably find a lot of these schematics in Legion layers. Though I've also heard the Legion is harboring special schematics for things called Elite Tech in Moscow. Better check Global Conflict. I 
After hitting three plus enemies with a grenade, Hollywood gains in power. When an enemy deals damage to Hollywood, there's 15% chance the attacks inflict enfeeble. Um, special ability damage is increased by 25%. I'm not playing favorites, but I particularly like this one. I gotta find out if I can quit multiple before I decide to make a fuck ton. I was wondering when I'd see you again. So that will increase its damage. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, so I can have multiple apparently. But if they focus on like a similar aspect, I shouldn't worry about them. just be equipped to anything so if they're just like passive abilities equip them to whatever but if they're ones that focus on abilities might as well equip, the, equip them to those said abilities mayhem duration that's important pack the problem is just like health and stuff doesn't drop all that much so these are ones I'm eventually not going to use anymore rations. I feel like everything's a pun and it's kind of a give and take. I like it, it's funny. Give hard hack a bit more of a Make you more of a tank. One of your packages was delivered to me by mistake, Relic. Please come claim it soon since it's labeled Cursed Statue. Eddie inflicts twenty percent bonus damage.
Oh, that's why. Oh no, they both inflict damage. One just freezes. The other stuns. Freeze is better because like, they do more damage. Uncharged Ramus arrow disperses its energy throughout the target's body, causing damage over. High frequency EM pulses help Rama target vital organs and increase critical hit damage. I want to be able to shoot faster and like faster damage over time. May not be doing as much damage, but they're all getting hurt, so it eventually adds up. Alright. Now I want to do those world conquest missions. Who the fuck is watching me today? Commander Root, Slow Cool, Ted, and Avocado Badabo. Thank you, Avocado, for coming back, and hello, Ted. Ow, fuck! Hit my toe and drop my phone. Attention, I am not the most gracious. Attention, please. I have received notices that several of you uh -uh. are in violation of the Ark's strict no pet policy. Now, I would hate for any sweet nub nubs to end up jettisoned from the Ark at an elevation of several thousand feet. Dude. Oh, you can only do one agent? Ah, that's gay. I'm assuming... Should probably unlock more agents. That'll probably help. Operation Hard Ass. Hard Tack gets some aggression out on Legion while Hollywood pitches his franchise force merchandising plan. But I didn't get the red skin. Red's my favorite color. I don't like her as a... Like, she's... On what she does individually, so... Destroying Legion tracking equipment. Is that the vehicles? The open world in this game seems pretty fucking empty. So I'm not super big on exploring right now. Has anyone talked in the chat? Not that I could see. 
Although I am just looking at it on my phone right now, so it might have missed something. there should be races in this game with the vehicle controls not being so bad. Tell himself what well, lets him sleep at night. But me, I know better. <laughs> I was there in the ship when Legion reared his ugly ass head. You fist fought a man with a spear. Buddies are sleeping with the fishes now. And there's no way on God's green earth I'm letting Legion get away with that. How did you lose your eye and grow a beard? Wait, why am I questioning his ability to grow facial hair? All right, Hardtack, you're up. Time to show Persephone what Franchise Force can do. We are not calling ourselves Franchise Force. Look here, I don't have nothing to prove to nobody. I just need to get some aggression out. You know what I'm saying? Of course, buddy, of course. Nothing to prove. <laughs> Wink. Yeah! In the beginning, I thought he kind of sucked just because he had to get close and he took so much damage, but... How much damage his shotgun does really makes a difference. And I think his ability is really growing on me. I want to fight the guy he fought in that cutscene. Seems like a good boss fight. God damn it. How do you get a... Oh, shit. Death. Why are you invulnerable? You want me to fuck it up, don't you? Don't you? Oh, that's that's just cheap. Don't you? 
Uh, them repeating their shit though, that's uh... Uh, I think it's definitely glitch. Not gonna lie, kind of like everything without the hood. But uh, this, this, this is not supposed to be happening right now. Friday, you there? I'm always here, Hollywood. Always. What do you think about franchise force? For what? A team name. For me, hardtack and fortune. Hmm. Well, at first blush, I'm not necessarily opposed to it. I enjoy the alliteration. Let me digest. Hey, 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 you people mind? I'm killing Legion over here. Why are you invincible? You can come in. Oh, night. Love you too. I shut my head off. I think you wore him out, Tack. Might be time to find a new spot. <laughs> I think you might be right. Uh, I don't. Motion blur, disabled. Camera shake, disabled. Subtitles, enabled. Uh, is there, is, I don't, I don't know where to go. I'm stuck in a glitch. How long has this game been out? Damn it. Where am I supposed to go?
I have no idea. Was this? Is this it? No. That's the main mission. Was my mission supposed to end here? Because I think this is... What the fuck? Here's the rest of them. Hollywood. France. You love it, right? Tell me you love it. I can see it. Franchise for multicultural intersexual fighting unit battling the football. Great look for the brand. No, I'm all about the brand. Do I have a say in this? Do you have a say? This is supposed to be my mission. I wonder what the hell happened to my HUD when I finish this mission. See if I know where the fuck I'm going and shit, and it doesn't make me go far away. I'm gonna go back to base and hope. But time to see. You're really kicking the old hornet's nest now, Tack. Yes, Hollywood. That's the franchise for spirit. All three of you, friends. Partners equals an aspirational expression of a new post-racial, post-gender society. Hollywood, you see this is getting oh, out of God. hand, right? Okay, people, if we're gonna talk about this now, let's talk about it. Fortune, what's your beef with Franchise Force? It's a catchy name, isn't it? Yeah, sure. But all the agents of Mayhem are a team, you know? Why do we need sub-teams? To sell action figures and t-shirts and lunchboxes. Lunchboxes! Lunch boxes are pretty sweet, Fortune. Hey, I'm not debating that. I'm just saying all of Mayhem is a single team. How are you gonna fit all the agents on a lunch box, Fortune? He has a point. Boom. I gotta admit, this game might be able to hold me down until Crackdown releases. I mean, still more content than Crackdown 2 would ever be. The only good Crackdown was the first one. And I'm afraid they're gonna find a way to fuck up the third. Because literally the second one was just go to layers of zombies and kill them.
There wasn't like missions to take down drug lords, it was all fucking zombies. That's supposed to be the guy. Hopefully this fixes my fucking HUD. That was the problem I was dealing with. I couldn't see my fucking health. I didn't know shit. <sighs> I guess not. It's a little six now. Damn, that pisses me off. I got you, Mayhem. Honey lit. Franchise force. You love it, right? Tell me you love it. I can see it. Franchise force. A multicultural, intersexual fighting unit battling the forces of evil. It's a great look for the brand. Oh, you know I'm all about the brand. Do I have a say in this? Do you have a say? This is supposed to be my mission. Come on, let's dance. Fire Fire it down. Down. Your I don't even have my reticle. What the fuck, game? Yeah, after I finish this mission, I might just call this game quits for the night and play something else. Like Assassin's Creed or something. What time is it, anyway? It's only 10.50. Advance! Advance! <laughs> a construction site. This is gonna go well. Now you piss me off. 
Another for the collection. It's nest now, Tack. Just doing what I do, Hollywood. That's the franchise for spirit. All three of you. Friends, partners, equals. An aspirational expression of a new post-racial, post-gender society. Hollywood, you see this is getting out of hand, right? Okay, look, people. If we're gonna talk about this now, let's talk about it. Fortune, what's your beef with franchise? For? It's a catchy name, isn't it? Yeah, sure. But all the agents of Mayhem are a team, you know? Why do we need sub-teams? To sell action figures, and t-shirts, and lunchboxes. Holy shit, lunchboxes! Lunchboxes are pretty sweet for you. Hey, I'm not debating that. I'm just saying all of Mayhem is a single team. How are you gonna fit all the agents on a lunchbox, Fortune? Prove it. From an advertising perspective, he has a point. Jesus, how many fucking shots with a shotgun? Sure, I kill all the small guys. They don't focus on the big guy. How many fucking times? enough legion corpses for now. Artak, my man, I am impressed. Franchise force is in full effect. Speaking of, I talked with Carolyn HR about getting some franchise force costumes made up for you three, since you're the faces of mayhem and all. Costumes? Seriously? I do like <laughs> having style options. Man makes a point. Operation Hard Ass. Necessary force. Uh -huh. 
should be done with work by five tomorrow. And I have a haircut, groceries, and I get paid tomorrow at midnight, technically, but technically it's Monday. Oh, I don't have to go to school for another month. God, I'm fucking loving it right now. <clears throat> I'm gonna turn my light off in my room. Uno minuto. Okay, this, yeah. Please fix this. If you feel fabulous, then you will look fabulous. It is all about the attitude. That might be the only thing out of all of this that actually, like, makes sense and isn't fucked up. Like, I think the first one on my streams was wash your nuts so you don't get STDs. <laughs> I'm just like, oh, common sense, but uh, okay. Fortify when he dashes. I forgot there was even a dash button. Got this from the days as a varsity lineman. Deploy more mines. Greater damage to commanders. That that's actually very helpful. Um, I'm gonna replace. I gotta admit, right now. Still digging Hollywood. Rama's ability kind of blows. So let's let's replace Rama and see if see if this game fixes itself. continuation mission if it lets me um okay so you cannot choose them wow I need to get skins for him I think you get at least one by leveling up. Okay, so Franchise Force is the red one. So, is his the red one? Yep, Franchise Force is the red one. I like the Franchise Force one. Ironic. The Incredible Yeti. Yeah, there's a Hulk one. There's a Steel one. There's a Rock one. Reminder, the Mayhem employee picnic is for personnel and their spouses And just him in a full bodysuit. I'll set it at that for now, since I've got a lower level. 
And I'm gonna do Yeti's mission if my reticles are fixed. No longer a danger, yes? Hey, hey, people, let's do this. Locked and loaded. Oh, yeah. Is that a fucking. Is that what he puts his vodka in? That's massive. A job to do. Oh, my reticle's fixed. Uh, but my objective marker. Where the hell am I? To the left, down a block, and then to the right. Wrong way. Damn it, game. Why do you have to glitch out on me? One thing I fucking hate about new games. Oh, thank God, at least the road sign. I'm so powerful. Come back soon. Please tell me I get to play this with my squads, or am I just Yeti? Don't get me wrong, I like the solo missions, but it's... Cold finger. There's a Legion Ice Barrage weapon not far using that General Winter Tech. Get close enough and I'll hack the code to... To find a list of everything they're using the technology for. An excellent idea. So, you ever gonna explain to me what this General Winter is? It is my country's secret defense technology can also create cold warriors like myself. And if Legion has it, they might be creating their own cold warriors. I see why that's a bad thing. Exactly. Just getting close. I'll do the rest. No problem. What the fuck? What am I supposed to be doing? I'm assuming it's the tower. Cause if not, I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. Cool. Now stay close to it. Well the barrage machine. Being near it is freezing my weapon faster. Hold on. I can fix that. Yeti, you didn't go there without backup, did you? A little busy right now, brother. Yep, looks like the refrigerator did. What are you up to anyway? Making certain Legion has not created their own cold warriors. Please excuse me, ladies. Will 
Sweet, I think it killed both of them. I think I found the problem. Back to normal yet? Greetings! I'm killing you for pride! What is this? Now my gun does not freeze at all! Okay, okay. Hang in there while I find the problem. You know, I've been meaning to ask. Are you the only Cold Warrior your military created? If you must know, as of today, yes. It is hard to find volunteers for the process. Bullshit! To be a kick-ass super soldier and be able to chill their own beer. There are that... other complications. May I get back to killing Legion now? Don't let us stop you, big guy. Wait, is one of the complications like limp dick or something? Giving you invincibility. I know I fixed it. How's it working? This is not right. Hurry up. You won't get away from me. So, what complications? Seriously, Daisy. What? I want to know. If you I'm curious know, as well. Because of the inability to be intimate with a woman. Oh, come on. So you're a little cold. Sometimes a little ice can be fun. I mean, it can't be that bad. Have you ever put your tongue on a frozen pole in winter? Shit, did that once on a dare. I'm still missing some skin. Uh, pole referring to your dick. Ah, got it. I was gonna say, I thought it was something involving sex. Feeling chill? <laughs> Make it work right. Fight smart, take cover. I think you powered it up. Okay, okay, hold on. When you're with a woman, can't you just, you know, not go frost dogging? Frost dogging. Uh, she means, can't you just wear protection? If it was insulated, maybe. But then, you know, this is an inappropriate conversation to have with ladies. Don't worry. Daisy don't count. Hey, you bet I'm a fucking lady. Hey, 
Uh, I'm having doubts. the data from the barrage weapon. I don't see anything about the Cold Warrior project, so that secret's safe. Quite the relief. Light that thing up, man. Got no use for it now. Absolutely. Yes. Now it is time to thaw out Legion's future plans for General Winter. I leveled up twice on that mission and became uncomfortable. All in one go. can I do now? A group of ex-marines turned pride troopers are looking for a fight and looking to draw out someone from their past. Here's Pierce. I knew you could get Pierce. I think there's actually a rocket car. So, never mind. I don't need to get the prompt to press Y on those things. This is the most annoying glitch I've ever had. Today's a big day for me, Agent. Pat Lee Leibowitz, my pen pal from Stillwater, is coming into town. I need your help in rolling out the red carpet. Could you get me a kick in ride so I can pick up Pat in style? Nerd. I mean, I started it ironically, but then Pat and I really hit it off.
I've noted the area for repair. Also note the woman's face who I crashed my car into. I only did 50 damage. Looking for a kick-ass ride. Yeah, that's it. Well, it's out of a series of missions. Acquire a vehicle. not specify which one at least it doesn't through me so I gotta figure this shit out Oh yeah, I guess it doesn't matter which one. God damn, I can't drive. Not the vehicle that was looked for. Where's this supposed vehicle at? Yes. Don't even know what the fuck I got out of that. Where the hell am I supposed to- <sighs> For fuck's sake! God, I need to go through my friends list and start deleting people. I keep getting notifications and I don't even think I know half these people. At least not anymore! Uh, voice, it is going good. Ah, uh, but my game is glitching out, so... Currently, I am... Uh, by the way, thanks for talking in the chat. I enjoy it. Uh, I actually enjoy when people interact. <sighs> my Mayhem game apparently has decided to tweak the fuck out, and it, it took away my reticles, and now it has taken away objective markers instead of reticles. Originally, it was both. So... Yeah... I don't know what vehicle I'm supposed to take. Maybe I should just try them all.
Uh, why are there enemies? And why can't I drive? Got this for PS4, waiting for it to finish. Um, it's not a bad game. It's pretty neat, actually, the characters and stuff, but yeah, no, uh, it is still very much flawed. I got it for free because the Game Pass has it. I'm playing on Xbox. But yeah, no, they... This is... Oh my god, I fucked up. I appreciate it. Um, god damn it. Yeah, but right now, I was playing my last mission, and um, for some reason, I activated my ultimate, and it just glitched the fuck Today's out, and Pat, took away my pen everything. It's coming into town. I need your help in rolling out the red carpet. Could you give me a kick? And ride so I can pick up Pat and Style? Nerd. I mean... I started it ironically. I mean, you're not wrong. Have you played really Fallout 76? Off. I love it. But it is flawed as can be. Let's see what this baby can do. Hmm. I played it for an hour once on PC, but this was like five bucks. Oh, yeah, it's it's free as shit on Xbox right now. I'm like a bunch of games for the Game Pass. The Game Pass isn't bad. Yoink. I think PlayStation has a similar thing, but Xbox is kind of better just because of the fact they'll give you like newer releases for free and. <laughs> A lot of the releases that are free on that aren't, on the PlayStation 1, aren't, like, the best. I, I mean, I have both consoles. I just I just prefer to play on my PlayStation, or Xbox, like that. just because most of my friends are on Xbox. This is not the vehicle I need. I can't even see my health bars. <sighs> this is annoying. Yeah, see, I moved back to my hometown recently, and like all my old friends, they just play PlayStation, um, which is fine because we can at least play together on Fortnite, which I'm okay with. Um, I'm not the biggest fan of that game, but just being able to play with them is purely the whole reason. And um, yeah. I might get PS Plus eventually, but like, I don't know. The only games I like on PlayStation are their single player exclusives, and that's like maybe one a year that are worth the crap to me. Because I was not a fan of Uncharted or The Last of Us. Surprisingly, I just didn't like them.
why I'm getting attacked by so many goddamn enemies. Ow. <sighs> yeah, I know the glitch thing is like really messing with all the stuff I'm doing right now. I don't even know what I'm doing right now. I'd love to play with some friends, but they all play Final Fantasy... Is that 15? Or no? No, no, that's FIFA. And I ran out of the subscriptions for the game, so I haven't been playing games with them. I just got Prototype 1 and 2. They're fun, but old. Oh yeah, I have those for this. They're not bad. They're, they're, they're decent games, but... God, they are something awful. What, what fucking vehicle do you want me to get? Is it the blue one? Nope. Maybe it's one of the ones in this parking lot? No, Final Fantasy, Realm Reborn, okay. So I was right. What did I just get? So it's none of these vehicles, where the fuck's the vehicle at then? Couldn't have been that big one. One, because the big one was destroyed and I didn't get any objective notification. Honestly, don't know what the fuck I'm supposed to be doing right now. I know I'm supposed to find a vehicle, but all the ones I've checked, they're uh, not accessible. I get games having bugs, but like, this is literally game breaking. can't be right. Where the fuck is it? I'm gonna guess it's maybe that van right here? Nope. Not this one either. This, this is a pain in my ass. I honestly might switch games now, because this game has pissed me off. This is wonderful. Makes a great hobby for 
I guess I'll go hunt down chests and kill enemies, because... Yeah, no, this game is literally fucking with me. It, uh... It craves for my soul to be destroyed. I'm debating on what game I should play next. Uh, I have the new Tomb Raider, and I have yet to try that out. If I play Assassin's Creed Odyssey, I'm gonna play that bitch for hours without stopping. I see. And I do have to get up in the morning, and it is 11:33, so I've got maybe an hour left in me. Fuck. I approve. <clears throat> I don't care if I failed. Just... Can I just restart the mission from checkpoint maybe and that'll fix it? Odyssey or prototype? I love prototype in the past, so I got that. Um do you know I think they sell Prototype 1 and Prototype 2 in like a small bundle for not much. I need your help in rolling out the red carpet. Could you give me a kick and ride so I can pick up Pat and Style? I am Pentos with I I am in the central time zone. I started it ironically, but then Pat and I really hit it off. I'm gonna have to call... You've got the bundle of Prototype 1 and Prototype 2 for $49.99. Yeah, I hate to tell you, on Xbox it's like... like 20 bucks at most. <coughs> Damn it. You know how people say wait an hour after eating before you go swimming? That's bullshit. <laughs> I enjoy what Presenti has done with the place. Uh, so to complete one region to unlock the next. Nah, I don't care. I get paid weekly, so it should be fine. I mean, I get paid weekly too, but... I don't know. Like, I'm super picky when it comes to, like, prices and shit for games, and I'll fucking find the lowest price. Like, I think I got Assassin's Creed Odyssey, Fallout 76, the new Tomb Raider, and, uh, what was the other one? Oh, Dragon Ball Fighter Z. All four of them for $120. Ugh. 
fuck. I've been obsessed with Assassin's Creed Odyssey, dude. I think that... No offense to Prototype 1 and 2, but I think Odyssey is superior in every way. And yeah, it's a newer game. But... Like... The game is so fucking good. I think I've streamed, like, th it three or four times, and, like, each time I've had to play for, like, four hours, or I just don't feel complete with myself. <laughs> you see, I have the same problem with Origins. It's not bad, but it's not the best. Like, the story's really good, but then you'll lose interest the moment you get into open world, because it, like, it's kind of like... Skyrim handles its story decently. Like, it makes you feel so okay in the open world and follow us the same way that you don't even give a shit about the main story, but you'll eventually come back to it, and... The story's not bad enough to, like, drive you crazy, but... <sighs> Origins, the story it tries to go for the whole, like, open-world Fallout vibe, and it just doesn't sell, not to mention, like, the level jumps in Origins just seem... But the level jumps in, um, Odyssey are great, and then you get hunted by bounty hunters and shit. It's so good. It has a nemesis system from... Shadow of War in it, but instead of, like, that for just regular enemies, it's for, like, mercenaries who will hunt you when you're wanted. So, like, being wanted has something more than just enemies are gonna attack you now. And you can almost go, you can go most doing any stealth at all. There's specific missions that kind of want you to be stealthy, but in all honesty, it's between. I did like Origins just because they really perfected the combat in that, but, like, they didn't reward you enough for sneaking, I thought. Odyssey, Odyssey is really where all of that stuff just comes to shine. Hmm. Uh, I'm gonna have to call it on this game at least. I can't deal with the fact that like my objectives, my health, and none of that shit's deciding to show. Or my ammo. Yeah, my reticle's gone again too. Fuck. I don't know what game I truly want to sit down and play all the way through. Friends let me borrow Red Dead 2 and it's fun, but I don't know. Getting bored too easily with games. And, yeah, I, I could agree. Uh, I think the game industry as itself is just... There's a lot of games that just get so tiring. Like, I couldn't complete... I I played, like, almost every Far Cry to ever exist in this Earth. But, like, the one I couldn't beat was the newest one because I kind of just fucking hated it. Like... It wasn't bad, and I knew it wasn't bad, it's just I could not find enjoyment from playing it. And, like, the more I played it, the more bored I became. Anyway, if you want to watch more of my videos or fucking talk more on my stream, you're welcome to, man. Just, um... I, I, I stream quite a bit, at least three or four times a day. A, uh, sometimes more. It just depends. Um, right now I've just got a new job and my work schedule is a little bit different, but I will normally stream around this time and then sometimes in the middle of the day, especially whenever I have my two days off, which are coming up, because I'm off Mondays and Wednesdays, so I'll work Monday, come into work, and then not do anything. So if you want to follow so you can catch up on it, I do warn you on, like, breaks and shit, I... 
know, Yeti. What do I you will call post so many summer? fucking videos. <laughs> yeah, I get it. The snowman melts and turns to water. Nice. It's funny joke, yes? Uh, Far Cry 2 kind of blew dicks just because, the, like, the sickness still, like, really fucked with, like, the progression it felt like. Because you constantly had to get pills, and I didn't know that. So at the start of that game, I just used up so many of them dicking around. And I couldn't find the supplier for pills fast enough, and I just kept, like, dying of malaria or whatever the fuck it was before I could reach him. Because I didn't know that the pill dude that you can go back to to get your pills refilled, that he eventually runs out. And that, like, super fucked me. And what's your time zone voice? Yeah, Far Cry 2 has to be one of the shittiest of them all. Not switching your weapons fucking break. It's annoying as shit. schedule should normally work out with my like normal streaming deal because I normally work from like <clears throat> I normally work um, like 5 to 10 or 5 to midnight and occasionally I work mornings but when school st uh, starts I'll switch from full time to part time and because um, right now school's out and um then I won't work as much, and if I do work, it's either going to be fewer days with more hours, um, or more days with fewer hours, because I'm fine with like getting like 20 hours just because I make like nine dollars and like a little over. It's like 9.20 an hour, so. So yeah, if you uh, ever want to watch my streams, dude, just hit me up with a... Well, did you follow already and I haven't seen it? Hit me up with a follow and um, yeah, I'll fucking talk to you, man. And I'm thinking of hopping back into Fortnite. So if you have that game and just need some friends to play with, I know it's free and it's cross-platform. Yeah, I might play it with you. You know, I I just like streaming so I can get to talk and meet people. But since it's like in the middle of the school year, it's been a little hard for me to get people who like comment anymore. And I got to admit, it's kind of been a bummer. Fortunately, you hate Fortnite. I fucking hate it too. But like. It's the only game I can play with my friends right now, so I learned to kind of cope with it. Ah, fuck.
but I'd watch, just don't care for gameplay, like personally playing. Yeah, no, it's fine. I don't really stream that game. I used to, but it wasn't like, it wasn't one of those fucking cash grabby cunts that was like, oh, I'm playing Fortnite, watch me. I was like, oh, when the game was brand fucking new in season one, I played it with my friends and then everyone got obsessed with it and then I just kind of lost interest just because, like, you know, one thing that made me hate that game was like, back in high school, I was I was a video game kid, you know, and like, it's not picked upon as much now as it used to be, but like, I was coming in the end of when like, video games were still considered, uh, nerdy, and like, the only w exception to that apparently was if you played sports games, you weren't nerdy, and um, so I had a lot of dickheads just be assholes to me because of, um, just because I played a whole lot of video games, um, preferably jocks, and now like, the same fucking dickheads who can't keep a job and have like, kids that they can't even take care of, yeah, they, um, they play the fuck out of that game. Ah, come on, land on top. And, um, post shit like that on their Snapchat of the game, and I'm just like, are you fucking with me? 22 year olds are posting fucking wins on Fortnite on Snapchat, and I'm just like, oh, are you fucking re. It's, it's one of those things where it's like people are so fucking hypocritical. That, like, I realized that if douchebags were getting into that game, then I was getting the fuck out. Ah, fuck. Did it not let me dash? Or can I not dash after the... I can't dash after the second one. And I'm falling. must be my lucky day. Need someone who's better at traversing. But, um... Yeah, no, I stream a lot, especially during these hours. And if you just ever feel like fucking talking to anyone about anything, dude, fuck, I'm down. Because, like, I like having conversations and stuff with people, and, you know, I... I like human interaction. It's not bad. Um... Some people are fucking nuts though, so it sucks, but no, streaming and all that stuff I've really gotten into lately, but like more, huh? I'm right now it's like kinda like the off season for me. Because I'm not like a big fucking streamer, so it's the middle of school and I'm not a big shot or whatever, so it's harder for me to get people who watch my stuff at this time. And like, I post these videos to YouTube as well. Some of them aren't as entertaining as others, but normally when I play with my friends, dude, I'm fucking happy and we're digging around Seriously? and having a good time. You wanna fuck with me? Exactly, you know, and like, um, I started streaming about, I'd say it's pretty much been a year, I've been streaming for about a year now, um, and you know, I've, I've, I've somewhat enjoyed it, um, it's just been, it's a little under a year, probably, but I've really enjoyed it, and I like it, and whenever I was starting off, it was hard to build up people. I got to a point where I was really happy, but then, like, everyone got busy because of the school year and shit, so it's kind of sucked because my chats have been really empty, so I have not been paying attention to them at all. Because I know no one's talking in them. <clears throat> so, in as a streamer, like, 
getting to where you're like, ah, I'm finally starting off, and then you get to a point where it's like, ah, everyone's busy. Kind of a bummer. But it happens. Kicking for everyone. Yeah. See, I usually wait to see if someone has a mic before I say hi because I've been in streams where I say hi and they never respond, so I leave because there's no interaction. And, like, as a streamer, especially when people get big time, they do that fucking seclusion shit for, like, their prime members or whatever, where, like, you have to pay to be seen in the chat. And I think that's bullshit. I think it should be an incentive for you to be noticed more, like, the way your chat's set up, so that way, if you put down money, yeah, I think yeah. you should be fucking seen, but, like, that doesn't mean that you shouldn't be able to fucking see your regulars and call them out every once in a while, and I've, I've seen a lot of streamers that once they, like, got big, they just, they pretty much told their fans to fuck off, and I'm big into watching YouTubers and stuff like that, and, like, see... Like I said, the reason I hate Fortnite so much is uh, because a lot of YouTubers who had specific Watch content the moment Fortnite came out and there was a rise in demand for it, they just became famous. Fortnite streamers and went against everything they'd ever done. And well, it was, that wasn't so hard. It was one of those situations where you're just like, what the hell? This, this isn't who you are. But they don't care. And I, I wanted to stream because I, can do I, this. I wanted to have fun and meet people and establish a community of people who can talk, interact, and just like come to talk to other gamers and people interested in video games. Just, just kind of build up a community of people who can all relate to one another and like have a good time. That is the Huzzah. reason I started streaming. Because it looked fun and I wanted to make friends. The more the and I just... Yoink. I just keep seeing all the bullshit and it starts pissing me off. And like Bring it on, baby. There's a lot of that shit that I just don't agree with. Watch out, there's more coming. Oh. <clears throat> oh shit, there's another digger. Anyway, I don't know if you followed me, but after I destroy this digger, I'm gonna end my stream and start up another stream of a different game. And I'm gonna go through and figure out which one I wanna do. So, just letting you know. Because this game has been glitching out, and I think it's about time I just kind of stop playing it. Because I've reached the two hour mark as well, so. One sec. See, I have a bit of social anxiety, and when I started to stream about four years ago, it helped me meet some fun people, and I met most of my gaming friends because of streaming. Really? How far have you gotten into streaming? Like, do you do raids and shit? Cause I don't, I don't know how any of that works. I don't know how to do raids. 
so I'm actually kind of curious. And I'm also curious on like what other people have done with their stream communities. Even ones that live in the same state as do, uh, see, uh, so live in the same state as do, so that was a plus. And yeah, when you start the next one up, I might pop back in. All right. Well, I am enjoying talking to you, so I'm gonna start up another stream of a different game just because this one's glitching out, and I've kind of just gotten pissed off at it. And yeah, I'm not sure what I'm gonna do yet. I'm kind of just thinking of relaxing, so... And I'm just not invested in single-player games at the current moment. I think I know what I'm going to play. So, one sec.